Breaking news this evening in the trial of Theranos founder Elizabeth Holmes. The jury has reached a verdict. Elizabeth Holmes was found guilty of a large-scale investor fraud. The woman who always seemed to have all the answers now had none. I, I don't know specifically. I'm not sure. I just don't know. Hey, welcome back. I think we should free Elizabeth Holmes. We should free Elizabeth Holmes. We should free Holmes. In the valley, you gotta fake it. So you make it, you know, we should free Holmes. We should free Elizabeth Holmes. We should free Holmes. In the valley, you gotta fake it. So you make it, you know, we should free What good does this do to society to put her behind bars? I mean, she's even a mother now. She just gave birth to a new kid. Why do we want to separate a mother from her children? I don't think that would do any good for society at all. Put her in charge of another company. Or give her another company to run. And I think she would make back at least some portion of the money that she lost for investors. Maybe even 10x. Talking about Steve Jobs, you know, he created this next computer cube in which he told people it would do all sorts of things. It was really just this box. This empty box that pretty much did nothing. You know, I still think we should let Elizabeth Holmes free. We should free. way your entire way of thinking is flawed and you will never be successful with some of the thought patterns that i see in here the top comment here i think it's about time a male dominated species become more equal to women now here's a good one she fully knew she was facing a long sentence yet still decided to have a baby in my opinion to get some sympathy from the jury and you know what yeah she gets the sympathy take a thought experiment let's imagine you were living a beautiful life you have a beautiful spouse you're living out in the garden of eden eating ambrosia and life is just beautiful out there do you wish harm on other people around you would you wish ill will for other people given the overabundance of joy i'm not necessarily saying that she does not belong in jail actually i am but thus far, the arguments appear to be politically charged based on sexism, racism, or circular logic and rhetoric. So that'll do for me though. Hope you guys enjoyed the discussion. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And otherwise, I'll see you in the next one. Thanks. Bye.